It's on. Hey guys. <laughs> hey guys, it's Jason J. Daniel. I'm here outside Vandalay Hair Industries, and we're here for another fun, exciting episode with Shelby. Hi guys. So I brought Shelby. She is gonna be our model today, and here is <laughs> her information. You need to follow her on Instagram. She models and she what else do you do? I just graduated. She just graduated. This is the graduation edition, guys. She graduated from a fine university here in the Sacramento area. Yep. And what's your major? Majored in history. History. And what else? History and a minor in Eastern European and Islamic studies. Wow, the brilliant. The brilliant, Shelby. Okay, so what are we gonna do today on you? Let's show what we need to do. Okay, look, it's, it is going this way, guys. You see, it's, see that? It's going that way. We're, we're, uh, we gotta, we're gonna even that out. See, we, some of the layers are long. And then we're also gonna, look at the color. Okay, you see this? It's still kind of shiny, we like that. But, and it's, but it's kind of a brown red. We don't want that, right? No, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go a ruby brilliant red. We're gonna take out the rootiness. She, no roots, no roots that she wants. And we are going to make the entire thing nice and shiny and brilliant. We're gonna try, right? And since she's a history major, we're gonna to try to make history today, right? All right, guys, follow us inside and you'll be able to watch, oh yeah, and follow her on IG, and you'll be able to watch exactly what we do today. <laughs> All right, so we're just looking at, her hair is super thick right here. Super thick in this area. Actually, it feels very healthy. And then as you can see, as I'm running my fingers through it, fingers are kind of getting stuck. Things are really dry. What? You know, also we're gonna talk about getting her into a better product line. So that's a conversation we might have later on. And I just wanted to give you guys a feel for how thick her hair is. And then also, the roots, so you can see her roots are darker. And we're gonna just take all that off. What we're gonna do on Shelby's hair is her ends are darker than the rest of her head because she put on some of the color herself. So we're gonna do a color balance, or some people call it a bleach wash. I'm gonna use a little bit of Matrix, Light Master. We don't really need toning power. We have it in this, there's some toning blue. No big deal to me, I just need a little bit of lifting power. We're gonna do a five volume, because I really don't need a lot of punch, and then I'm gonna put some uh, conditioner in the mix. Let's do two scoops. I'm gonna use Awapui as the conditioner. Just gonna go like that with it to break up all of that developer edge. I have her captured. You see that transition, guys? See the dark? There it is, a little lighter. So right where you see that transition line, right there, we're gonna go ahead and uh, color balance in with some bleach and conditioner. I have the bleach wash on her ends. She's happy, doing good. Still with me? Yes, yes. <laughs> so we're about to rinse probably in 10 minutes. See the difference? Perfect. Hey guys. I am blow drying Shelby's hair. We did bleach out the tips just a little bit with the bleach wash. You can see they're lighter. You'll be able to see the results pretty soon. But the, the most interesting part about this is tell them, Shelby, tell them what, what about, what's interesting about this blow dry? It's only the second time I've blow dried my hair in a year and a half. What, in how long? A year and a half. A year and a half? What have you been doing with your hair? Air dry it. Air drying it? <laughs> All right, yep. well, I'm so honored and privileged to be the third, <laughs> third blow dry you had in a year. Yep. <laughs> okay guys, now we are finally ready, finally, 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 to put the red on her head. I know, rhymes, right? Pretty good, pretty good. You know, I worked on that all day to get that rhyme. So we're gonna put on uh, Matrix So Boost. It looks like that. Very, very red. See? Wow, ruby red, you like that. All 
I just did her tips. You can see here, I'm getting a little red on it. You can see here that the top isn't done yet, but we're gonna do that last because of the heat from her scalp and we don't want to lift the roots much at all, which we're only gonna put a five volume in, so there really, it shouldn't be any lift. But you know what the secret is, is you have heat on your head. And because there's so much heat on your head, sometimes it'll act as five to 10 if you leave it on too long. This uh, So Boost is by Matrix, and this is a straight color pigment. We're also gonna throw in a little bit of developer, which boosts it a little bit, which it's recommended you put five to 10 in. I'll break that up a little bit so you guys can see where we're at. And you can see the darkness is the dimension. Some of it's the old color, but you can see there's a lot of red saturated in there, and you can see it on my fingers. I know, bad hairdresser, I should be using gloves, but I do wanna show you that there is a lot of red in there. All right, guys, you wanna see this color? Let's see how amazing this color is. Let's see. Oh, there it goes. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, this, that's rude. This color's making rude sounds. I'm gonna use a color key to get all of it out. Lock that in. Really focused on the color. She's so focused. Sorry, guys. All right, and we're just gonna look at how messy it's everywhere. Huh? It is so everywhere. I'm also using a spatula, as you can see, a spatula to just kind of use it to penetrate uh, the hair. And look at that. Kind of creepy. Got to be honest. Looks like brains, brains. <laughs> All right, so then we're gonna put five ounce or. Oh my God, you're so cool. <laughs> Am I so artistic? Like yeah. on it. Only one Let's mix. All right, so then we're going to do a second half of her head. Looking good so far. It's going to even be looking more fantabulous. I'm such a perfectionist. Are you ready? It's, it's going. Did you stop it and restart it? Yeah, I stopped it and restarted you're so, it. You're so good. What technique am I using? What do you think this technique is? Brushing forward? This is called, this is how I brush my teeth. <laughs> teeth. <laughs> teeth okay. brushing, right? All right, guys, so we've, um, now I'm just going right up to the mid shaft and staying off the root, because we don't want to get there yet, right? No root, not yet. I am covering up her older color, but it's like a shade darker, um, which is gonna be a really, essentially it's like a foundation for this color here. And then as that penetrates, some of the other, co her older color, we did do some bleaching earlier but uh, we're treating this just like painting it right on, very, using a soft brush. Her tips I've already put color on. Bringing it right up here, as you can see, right, but not on the roots yet. We're gonna do that last, right, Shelby? Yeah. Why do we wanna do that last? Because I have a hot head. You have a hot head. <laughs> <laughs> Smoking hot. <laughs> All right, now we're gonna power through. Thanks. Look how nice and red it's getting. I gotta jump on that root. Look at that, it's dope. So the last level of color is brought to you by J. Beverly Hills. We're going to use this really fun fashion color, sangria. It's like the booze. Do you drink? Oh, that's amazing. Do you drink sangria? Yes, I do. All right, Matt, let's just go get a drink. Just kidding. Picture or two? <laughs> yeah, picture. <laughs> so this is oil-based. A little goes a long way, but thank you to J. Beverly Hills. And we're going to put that on her roots and then process a little. We're looking good. You can see there's a lot of a different dimension. It looks darker than it actually is going to be. So let's see how it works, right? Okay, so this squirts out just like that. And it's oil-based, a little bit of red on me. It's oil-based, so I think that's really nice to put on the roots. There's no developer in it, so it's gonna keep us from lifting, which is what we don't want. So you can see her darkness in there. So I'm just gonna paint that on a bit. There we go. Just kind of saturate that, bring that up almost like um, Almost like a squeegee a little bit. And then we have, I have my handy dandy chopstick. Go in there and cut that a bit. And you can see we still have a little bit of root in there. We're almost wrapped up. And that looks really, really nice. And you still have that darkness in there, which is what we want. No lift, but a saturation and some nice dimension. I'm not doing any of the heavy lifting. As you can see, I have Mac doing all my blow drying, right Mac? Yeah, he's lucky. I'm so lucky to have her in my life. See, we also have Erica back there, but we didn't ask her permission to put her on video. So, hi Erica, how are you? Hi, dude. 
Good, Eric is assisting us as well. So, guys, um, here it is. Shelby. Hi. Hey, it is really nice and very vibrant. What do you think, Mac? Yeah, it's beautiful. It's beautiful? Yeah. What do you think, Erica? I love it. She loves yeah. it, right? <laughs> what do you think, Shelby? I love it. We love it. We haven't seen it dry. We, we, we love it, you know, wet. Yeah. And it came out odd. It came out super odd. Look at this. Wow, look at this. Pretty consistent, vibrant, and you know, we were concerned about the roots. Without really lifting them, our concern was to get them to match, have some consistency all the way through, but I feel like we've got that. So we're blow drying her, we're gonna style her up. Wow. We're in the safe zone. We back away from Jason and his camera. Yeah, watch out, because somebody might get hurt. Oh, how, that looks really nice. All right, feel free. <laughs> So, so now let's do some tips for a client. If you're yeah. not a stylist and you don't always do it yourself, yeah. give them one tip that can take them to the top. Product. Products, products. are going to make your life so much easier. Um, we can't make beautiful hair without the products we have. If you took all the products away from me, my styles wouldn't look as beautiful. So using and the you, right product. But you're always beautiful. Your, <laughs> Your clients, <laughs> make sure you're getting the right product to do your hair and um, getting that desired result. Our styling products are sponsored by J. Mac. Beverly Hills. Mac, <laughs> Mac, thank you, Mac. She she actually sponsored the Vandalay Hair Industries yes. and also by J. Beverly Hills. So tell us what products we're using today on our amazing model, Shelby. So today we started with detangling spray. That's gonna be your prepper. Um, this is kind of like adding um, a smoother to clean out all the holes. So your your hair has all the holes in it and we're filling them. <laughs> Shut up, Jason. So that's our first prep. <laughs> and then after that, we're gonna use five in one. It's gonna be your leave-in. Right. Okay, so it's gonna help you smooth out your hair. It's gonna protect you from the sun. I know it's hard to focus when you have this crazy man. <laughs> you want five in one. That's our, okay. What's our third product? So next, I'm gonna add that with our coconut oil. Coconut oil. Coconut oil has argan oil. It's grapeseed. Um, it's amazing. It really helps heal the hair. It's not just smoothing. So there's no silicone. So it's just gonna help heal and smooth. Two in one. Two in one. So step one is clear out the holes. Step two, smooth out the hair, and step three is heal it, right? Yep, heal the hair. Right on. So we're doing all that to Shelby. Next, you're going to see the final, final product. Amazing. All right, guys, we're <laughs> all done. We finally got it done. Did we do it? We did it. We did it. Did we make history? 
I yeah. think so. Yeah. All right, because she's a history major, and we wanted to make history because she just graduated. That's like, oh, you know, that's we're awesome. talking, right? She's like super brilliant, and now her hair is very brilliant. <laughs> Come on in. I want to let, let's just take a look at the hair right on. So, what do you think, huh, Shelby? I love it. You? It's my favorite color, and it's all even now. It's perfect. <laughs> so, uh, we, we did, we obviously knocked it out of the park with the color. We're really happy. Mac is awesome. She helped with the haircut. I did the beginning, and she refined it. It, it, remember in the uh, in the intro guys we had a little bit of an edge here but now we got some fun layers we made it nice and smooth and straight so you could take a look at how nice it is what did you get out of your experience today? I found out I love Jason <laughs> <laughs> you know what and uh, put me on the spot <laughs> <laughs> you know what it's good to be loved by really good people and you know what hey come on out to Vandalay Hair Industries which is Max Salon Mac is amazing. Erica Good. behind the camera, thank you Erica. Mac, thank you for the styling and the blow drying tips. Also thanks to Jay Beverly Hills that provided some of the red and also all the styling products. It was fun. It was fun. Guys, follow me on the internet everywhere at Jason J. Daniel. Follow Shelby where? At Shell Steps. Instagram. Instagram. Steps. She's a really yeah. awesome hot, smoking hot model. You gotta follow her. And Mac, where can we follow you? Hair by Mac. Hair by Mac and come to Vandalay Hair Industries get some hair done. Guys, see you next time. Thanks.